Hey guys, my name is Chow, and welcome to Franbo. This is a 2D horror-themed point-and-click adventure game by a studio called Kill Monday, and it's about a girl who's struggling with mental disorder. That's all I got from the Steam page, so <laughs> that's all I really know. Uh, let's just jump right in there. Sure. Alright. Everything's fine. It feels like heaven. I see my parents. They look happy. They have a present for me. I wonder. Oh, it's a cat! So sweet and pretty. Dark as the deepest night. It's Mr. Midnight. Doll. Oh, my best friend. My only friend. We were having dinner and I see Aunt Grace too. I really like her a lot. It's Friday. My parents are going out. Aunt Grace takes good care of me. Oh, look at the cat. We're having so much fun. It's a Monday night and I'm playing with Mr. Midnight. But something feels real bad. Whoa! A strange creature outside my window. Okay, definitely horror. I don't like it, it scares me. Suddenly I hear something. It's mom, screaming. I want to know what's wrong. A bright light shines from my parents' room. I go closer. Closer. Huh. Mom? Dad? Please don't. Oh shit! Mommy, Daddy? Whoa. I did not expect this. At all! What?! Oh, man. Holy shit. What do you see, Mr. Midnight? Oh, shit. Fran, please follow my voice. On the count of three, you'll wake up. One. Two. Oh, three. Fran, how do you feel? Uh, fine, I guess. Oh, I have to press the button? Okay, okay, I think I got it. Click in the middle. <laughs> That's okay. I'm fine, I guess. Just sad to see the same things. Sadness is something everybody has within. I want to find the killer. I really want to know who killed my parents. The police are working on it. Ugh. Everything just takes so fucking long. I'll find my cat and the killer. I'll find the killer and my cat. Your cat is missing. It would be impossible to get him back. What? But now I have something for you, Fran. What is it? See the desk? There's a little package for you. It's from Aunt Grace. Take it. Ah. This? This was my mother's purse. 
Open it, there's something inside. Lost and found. What's this? I can use combine or examine? Ooh, let's examine it. Dearest Fran, here is the purse you like so much. I thought you would like to have it. When I was thinking about you, I remembered that you like to examine objects and combine them with other things. So I hope you'll always keep this purse and give it and all the other things you find a good use. Never forget that creativity is the absolutely the greatest gift you have. Love Aunt Grace. Thanks Aunt Grace for the uh, not so subtle tutorial. She's worried about you. Aunt Grace. Aunt Grace? Well, another reason to let me go. Well, don't worry about her. She's fine. I... Can I... Go? Can I go to my room now? Are we in an orphanage? Yes, you can leave, but before you do, it's time for your new medicine. Oh, fuck that! What medicine? No more medicine. I don't want to try more medicine. Oh, I see you scribbling notes. It's called duotine, and it'll make you feel very relaxed. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit! Anything new today, Dr. Dern? Nothing, actually. Some visions are same visions as before. Oh, I see. Here, friend, take your medicine. No, fuck you. No. We don't have all day, Fran. Take the pills now. No. No, Fran, don't do it. Fuck you, nurse. Ugh. God. Can I... Ugh, pills. Fuck you, hate. Fuck you, nurse. Fuck you. Ugh. Spit him out. Spit him out. Oh, I don't feel so good. Whoa. No, oh, no. Take her back to her room. And yeah, nurse, don't let her take this ever again. Beware, friend, Bo. If you leave the house of madness, I will hunt you down. Catch you. And bring you back to insanity. Friend, wake up. The medicine will help you escape. I've been waiting for you in the forest. I love you. Oh, it's actually Mr. Midnight talking? I was expecting somebody else to show up. Mr. Midnight? Oh, my sober day. Okay. Oh, fuck that. There's a clown. That's fantastic. I'm still here. Hideous place. I have to get out of here. Eyeballs. Left and right. Oh, sweet, sweet melody. That's cute. Hmm. Let's see. Case name Franbo Dagenhart. Oh, so her full name, her full first name's Franbo? Hmm. Ten years old female. The patient was found near the Oswald Asylum showing signs of psychosis. The Bow Danghart family tragedy details omitted. Treatment? Mr. Marcel Dearn has tried different medications and all have been cancelled because of side effects. Okay. Some serious side effects. So her first name is Fran, actually. Bo Dagenhart is the family name. Gross. I'll get your nose. I'll get it. Are you a happy clown? Can you make me laugh? I'm having a hard time laughing again. Interesting. Locked. Holy moly, something fell. 
a handy hook. I'll have to play pirate later. Interesting. Golden hook that fell from the curtains. Oh, don't use it at all, actually. Good. Good, good. Don't want to just walk up. Can I take the cross? <clears throat> That'd be pretty ironic. Oh, hello, kid. Hey, Phil. Hello. How you doing, buddy? You don't look so hot. Everybody says that I'm sick. Oh, they're just stupid, Phil. They always say that. They're just stupid. Are you leaving tonight? Uh, I will if you help. The only thing I know is that the office is the key. Okay. You want to bust out of this joint, Phil? Hmm, there's a key inside? Is there a key inside the office? I saw the doctor write a secret code. Oh, do you know what it is? A secret code to open the yellow door? He doesn't want me to tell you. Who? Who are you talking about? Him? No, goodness. Whoa! All doors are closed. You are a prisoner of my games. And nobody will help you escape. Oh, leave me alone. I hate you. Fuck. Mommy, Daddy. I need you so much right now. I won't let that monster stop me. Thanks for helping, Phil. Okay. It's still in the office. Used to have a blue dress like yours. Can't play with you now. Okay. In that case. Fillmore Bronstone, age eight. History. The patient came to Oswald Asylum with his mother, Rachel Bronstone. The boy has developed paranoid behavior. Paranoia not yet diagnosed. Treatment. Daily treatment with Dr. Marcel Dearn. We have not uh, achieved the patient's trust and he refuses to be questioned. Huh. I wouldn't give them anything. Fucking doctors. Secret box. Yeah. Shh. Hope somebody loves you. Okay, Mr. Teddy. Anything else? A wooden horse. <laughs> okay, what's on this side of the room? My legs are just... What are you scribbling there, nurse? Everything... Mm. Oh, Fran, you're awake. Good. How long was I asleep? Three days. Wow! That's a long time. Oh, uh, was it the medicine? Yes, it was the medicine. That's why you're not taking it anymore. Good. Uh... Something happened. I forgot something happened. See, you're nothing but trouble. What is it? Fuck you, nothing. <laughs> okay. Towels. Don't need towels. Don't need blankets for our adventure. Empty bottles. In that case, I'll just leave. Ah, oh, fuck. Of course it's locked. There's... Is there... Is there an object underneath and or behind this chair oh no that's just it's just a white tile floor okay whoops still locked in that case I'm gonna use my hook with the door the shapes not right how about crack open this okay oh a key hello can I use this key to open this fucking door keys too tiny if it were bigger, I could take it down. Oh, huh. wait a minute. Okay. Combine tiny key with golden hook. Mm, looks like that's a no. Alright, I have a key. And I have a hook. What do I do with these things? Oh, can I climb out the window? Hell yeah. 
tower defense. We have for you a crazy prison, a crazy person called Fran. Looks like I can't. Hmm. Or is it defense tower? I guess that is my way out. Okay. All right then. Oh, a key. Use it on this. Yes. There's something inside. Oh, a photo. Tell my family. Mom, dad, and my aunt. My cat. Looks like this will work. Okay. How good are your lockpicking skills, Fran? I don't know if a 10 year old should be lockpicking the, oh, the hair clip. It fits, but there are two holes. I need something else. Oh, you do know how to lockpick. Shape's not right. Mm. Two holes in. Shit, what do I do? Examine this, my hair clip. Combine with this. No, so that, that's a no, right? Combine with... Okay. You need something else? I don't know why I'm... Duh! Alright, alright, alright. I don't know why I'm trying twice for things that I already know shouldn't be working. Red and Tiny are hiding from me. I hate the monster. I have to find Mr. Midnight. I have to find him now. I miss my kitty. He hides because he is afraid. He told me that the medicine would show me where he is. Okie dokie. Okay. Bullshit. I want to know what she's writing. I'm curious. She'll never let me touch anything. And there's something have oh hey nothing I got it uh I broke the curtains I was trying to look outside and I actually broke the curtains Psst, accidentally I have to fix this follow me I'm not following you I'm gonna read this shit okay there you go Is she okay in that case I have to go talk to her Something is missing. Have you seen the hook that holds the curtains up? What's a hook? <laughs> I'll have to go find something to fix this, you little, you little girl. Yeah, that's right. You get out of here. What's she writing? Violent trauma can have great impact on children, totally changing their normal lives. For example, children damaged by trauma can have mild to severe deficits in some abilities, such as trusting people near them, seeing the world as a safe place, making decisions, etc. Because of these effects, some traumas can lead to several symptoms of major mental illness. For example, not trusting other people or not feeling safe in the world. This can be interpreted as paranoia. No, well, don't that suck? Oh, that's what I was going for. Nurse name, Gladys. Franbo, patient name. The patient has... Oh god, my eyes. The patient has been sleeping almost all the time. She only wakes up to drink water. But I don't think she remembers that. After drinking, she goes to sleep again. She hasn't, she hasn't been social for three days now. Some kids have come around and asked about her and when she would come out and play. Oh. Okay. Wait, what does that say? Duotine. A-H. Hmm. Duotine. 8-H. Well, I do need to get that medicine, because Mr. Midnight said so. And 8-H looks like some kind of code. I think this is where the medicine is, but it's locked. Oh my goodness, look at that! The fuck? Oh. Uh, yeah, let's leave it as is. is. Wow. Okay. That's super weird. <laughs> Why the fuck does the nurse have a gun? Okay, well. I can't get out of here with the stuff I have. Why don't I just lay back in bed and open the sucker up? It's locked, right? 
use it. Oh. Combine it with this? No, okay. Combine it with this. Sometimes things just don't work. Yeah, you use this? Okay. Hide. What the hell? Okay, well, I definitely don't have the passcode. It's four numbers. Hmm, let's look out this window. Just the playground. Good night, moon. Good night, trees. Okay. I like the bunny swing thing, it makes me dizzy. Can I look out this, this window? It's all boarded up. Not so easy to see through this. Why? Oh. If somebody's already jumped through this window. Maybe I can break it. Can I break that window? <laughs> no. Okay. 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 Well, I feel like I'm going insane in here because I'm not sure how to get out. God damn. Oh, 1944. Oh, this is in the 40s. Crazy. Interesting. Probably has to do something with this H I D E. H I D E. Wait. H I D E. Oh. Oh, wait, 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 hold on. Wait, hold on, hold on. I don't know why I didn't think of this. I've been here for a little bit of time, actually. I did not realize it. Okay, yeah, H I D and E are all within the first 10 letters of the alphabet. So it's 8, 9, 4, 5? Is that right? Oh god, if this, if this is right, then it's actually more simple than I thought, and I just did not notice that. 8... I didn't, I didn't put enough stock into the letters hide right there. Um, 4, 5, there, god damn it. Alright. Kitties told me this would help. Uh, don't know about the pills, but this is all we have left, and we need one more object. I don't. I've been. I feel like I've been scouring around everywhere for this last object, though. It's something to stick into the door, the keyhole. Whoa. I s understand why it says. Okay. Get out, creepy creature. What are you, huh? Tell me. You like to see me sad? Alright. That's how it helps, huh? Hello, Miss Nurse. Are you alright? <laughs> Hello, huh? What's this? Oh, shit, a needle. Oh. Can I combine it with this? There you go. That's a key. Alrighty then. It wasn't me, dead rabbit. Are you sleeping, sweet bunny? <laughs> are you oh, Phil! Oh, why are you looking at me like that? You terrify me. What's that black thing sitting next to you? He's telling you things. Can you hear it? Are you okay? You can see a dead deer. Whoa! Oh no, your head! I'll try to put your head back on- Oh! Okay, I can't help you, Mr. Deer, I'm sorry. <laughs> Jesus Christ, man. Take the door to happiness. Yikes. Let's go downstairs. Who did it? Who murdered our parents? No, absolutely not. You can't tell her that. Is that my aunt? But she has to know. You can't keep me away from her. The reason is more than clear, Grace. No, it's not. I want to take her home now. You can't. Fran's medical condition is not appropriate yet. Um, Fran's mental condition. Okay. What the fuck is up with this doctor? I want to go home with my aunt. Oh, Jesus. The bed's back. Oh, Jesus! 
What the fuck? Oh god. Was that real? I wonder what she has to tell me. That doctor has no soul. I'm going home tonight. Hey. What you looking at? Hello. Whoa. Whoa! Oh, is that my head? Give me my head back, please. Just go away, you weird cre- you weirdos. <laughs> this girl. I feel like her reactions to what's happening is very inappropriate. She actually probably is dealing with a lot of shit right now. Oh my goodness. Would you like a hug, Mr. Fox? Why are you so sad? Don't cry, Mr. Fox. <laughs> Jeez, okay, okay, yeah, yeah. I think Fran's a little crazy. It's okay. We're all a little crazy on the inside. Phil, you're gonna die in here. Get out while you can, buddy. Alright, enough dawdling. I think I've taken enough time to look at all the crazy shit. What was that? Daddy was not there. Mommy would not care. What? Daddy was not there. Mommy would not care. You mean maybe their love was actually falling apart? Was their marriage falling apart? Was daddy cheating on mommy? Is that why daddy wasn't there? And mommy just stopped caring about whether what he was doing. Was it like a murder suicide? What's going on? It's a maze. Whoa! Hi, Mr. Midnight. You're my beloved friend, Bip Bip Berm. If you wanna hug me, try to catch me, Bip Bip Berm. If you can't catch me, it's because you haven't found me. Oh boy. Oh, this door leads there. What's, where's this door go? Oh, hello. I don't want to touch that. It's a clown from the painting. Oh, the clown from the painting is in the toy box. Oh, gross. Oh my god, this game is crazy. I like it a lot. Why do you look like a fabric doll? What have they done to you? Please somebody tell me something. Tiny hands all over you, eating your soul. Yikes. Okay. Even the purest of things die in this place. Yowza. You can see. Oh, uh, let's see if I can read this. Adel... Ad Adelia? Adelida? Fugans? Age 7? Female? The patient was a victim of sexual abuse by an unknown person, which almost killed her. This event has treated uh, auditory hallucinations and thought disorder. Hmm. Dr. Marcel Dearn has become close to the patient through drugs therapy. She is making progress. This poor fucking girl. Oh my goodness. That's... This is so dark. Am I a little crazy for thinking this game is pretty damn interesting? Maybe. Bathroom. The king likes drawings. Whoa! I don't like this. Somebody wrote something here. Interesting. The king likes drawings. It's a mirror. What if I use something? Okay, well, let's get out of here. Mm, can I use the hook? The hook is bad at opening locks. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. You can't okay well then the answer is in one of these keys I can I need to get mm, wait a minute what if I use the hook with the cat toy okay it doesn't work all right then anything in here worth the damn oh oh okay you can open the pill bottles or you can close them and things become more or less interactable. Okay, I see. You don't have to stay in Nightmare Land. Okay, I got it. Hi. You okay? You see them, you do, right? What What are you talking about? See what? The creatures that follow everyone. The shadows? You mean the shadows? Uh-huh. I can't see them, but I know they're... 
Oh, I know they're there. Because you have auditory. You have an auditory disorder, right? Do you know what they are? Yeah, I guess. Then please tell me. You like to draw? I love to draw. I like it too. But tell me more about the shadows. Crayon. A crayon. I want to find a crayon. I draw all the time. Okay, what are you drawing? Something. Okay, that doesn't tell me anything. What is it? My dreams. Go now. To f find you a crayon? Is that what you want? You want a crayon? Bed of very the bed is very pink. Okay. Um, red puppet and serpent, teddy and many other things. Nothing useful to me though. Can I grab something from the drawer now? Drawer is empty. And there's a clown. Maybe I can find her a crown. Oh, now I can leave this place. That's good to know. The throne is empty. I didn't realize that anyone could see me pooping. That's pretty gross. I can and we'll hold it. Okay. Oh shit. Ah, oh, there you are. You should be in your room. The door was closed. Uh, you left it open, lady. Yeah. I'm sure it was not open. I know because I locked it. How did I get out then? Huh? It was open, you fool. Don't try to trick me. Go inside your room and wait for the doctor. Damn. Okay, I have to find a new way out. Or did I just take too long? Maybe I can threaten her with this gun. <laughs> oh, there's a doctor. What do you want, asshole? Did you break out from your room? That's not nice, friend. I haven't eaten in days. I'm just. Yeah, I haven't eaten in three days. I've just had water. I'm hungry. I haven't eaten in days. I won't listen to any of your excuses, young lady. I'm not making up excuses. I haven't eaten in days. You have to learn how to listen to those in charge. Fuck you! Alright, whatever. You big people. You big people. Ugh, you big people. <laughs> Just don't do it again, Fran. Go and eat now, then get back to bed. Thanks, Doc. Hey. Hey, what's up, man? You wanna... It's in the office. Okay, gonna go find the doctor's code. Thanks, Phil. You're a cool kid, Phil. Maybe I can find a crayon on the way there. 